Hello everyone, my name is Arsh and a very warm welcome to all of you in this brand new course. Now you may be wondering why I am creating this course. So recently I raised a poll on my YouTube. So depending upon the responses from that poll, there is a tie between blog and e-commerce app. So I was confused which one to create. Then I thought, let's create both of them. Okay, so in this course, we will be learning about block architecture as well as block state management in Flutter. If you don't know what is block and how to use it, etc, etc, we will be covering that in upcoming videos. For now, to keep it simple, block is a state management library for Dart and Flutter like GetX, Riverpod, Providers and many others. Now let's move to what you will learn in this journey so we will start with the block fundamentals in the first section of this course in which we will cover what is block qubits and some flutter block widgets and stuff then we will move to block architecture uh, which simply means structuring our project in such a way that it can be used for a large complex application and finally the last section of this course which will be an e-commerce app using block state management in which we will be covering REST APIs and many other things. So this is the journey. Now before taking this journey, what you should know? So you should know fundamentals of Flutter and Dart, okay? Which means some basics of Flutter and Dart, how it works. And as I say, one of the most important requirement, which is a will to learn. So if you want to learn something new or you want to upskill yourself, you can join me in this journey. So thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Till then, bye bye.